pizza may have been invented in Italy, but deep dish pizza is an American creation thanks to Uno's. With over 140 restaurants across the country and around the world, Uno's history is as deep as their signature dish, as President and CEO Louis Salidas explains. So the history of Uno's is we started in 1943 in Chicago. We invented deep dish pizza. We're so the undisputed inventor of deep dish pizza. So fast forward, to the late 70s, Aaron Spencer, a Boston guy who's a Kentucky Fried Chicken franchisee, goes to Chicago for a convention. They serve a Boston guy deep dish pizza. He falls in love with it and literally hounds the founder, Ike Sewell, to sell him the business. Ike finally franchises it to him and Aaron opened in 1980 on Boylston Street. That store is still there today. Everyone usually thinks of us as a Chicago-based company. When I say no, you know, we're Boston-based. We were founded really by a Boston guy. People are surprised by that. Uno's executive chef Chef Andre Fuhr says he strives to make every pie just as legendary as the Chicago original. We hand stretch the dough each day, bake it into the pans, and build to order. So every bite is just filled with cheesy, meaty goodness. I mean, that's how I would describe it. Beyond pizza, Uno's new menu includes all kinds of upgraded appetizers like nachos, onion rings, and hand breaded zucchini chips. You can get a half pound burger topped with fresh made guacamole, a wild mushroom flatbread, or a slice of chocolate cake that covers an entire plate. And along with a new atmosphere and redesigned bars with a selection of craft beers, Uno's deep dish still dominates. It's irresistible. Once you get it in your mouth, I, I think you're hooked. So let's dig a little deeper into the deep dish with Uno's president and CEO, Louis Salidas. Louis, listen, I'm a guy who eats a, a lot of pizza, to be totally honest with you, and I don't discriminate. I have thin crust, I'll have the neighborhood pizza shop, I'll have Sicilian. Uno's to me is almost like its own category that like transcends pizza because it's more like, it's like a meal. I don't know. How, explain to me the, the process, whether it's the making, the serving, the taste. What is it that makes that Uno's deep dish so different than really all the rest? Yeah, it's, it's really a special product, Dan, and um, a lot of people might assume that because we're a chain, we don't do scratch cooking in our kitchens, and really the deep dish gets a lot of love and attention. Yep. And it, it starts with you know, the f a flour blend that is made for, for just us. It's a very proprietary flour blend. We make dough every day in the restaurant. We uh, allow it to sit and ferment for 24 hours to develop that character and flavor that you want in a good crust. We then bake that crust off in a deep dish pan with a little bit of oil in it. Mm. And it allows it to fry the outside of the crust and it creates that crispiness that when you combine that with the flakiness on the inside, it's it's an irresistible crust. Yeah, it certainly is. And, and the stuff on the inside ain't that bad either. I mean, between your nice chunky tomato sauce, maybe a little bit of cheese, uh, a little bit of, to say the least. Um, but you have all different styles. The, the one I usually end up getting though, cause when I'm going to Uno's, I'm just, I'm all in. I want the full experience. So I get this, it's called the numero uno, right? I mean, I assume that's gotta be one of the most popular ones. It, it is, it's, it's our top selling dish. Mm. And uh, again, it's made with the, you know, fresh ingredients, the, uh, the peppers, the onions, the tomatoes, all fresh, not out of a can. You know, pepperoni, you know, great pepperoni. Yeah. And, uh, and of course, Chicago style sausage. Uh, Why not? It's all in there. So that's it's our number one item. It's named after the brand, and it's really popular. Now, of course, you, you guys have really kind of embraced the whole deep dish thing. I mean, you're like going back to your roots almost, because listen, that's what I first knew Uno's for. That's what I'm continuing to go there for. And you even you're doing appetizers. You're even doing desserts that are kind of deep right. dish based. On the appetizer side, one of the most popular always for me has been the pizza skin. Now, this is a serious appetizer. It, it really is, Dan. Uh, it's one of my favorites. And we start off with that same just delicious crust that we use for the pizza. Mm -hmm. We fill it with real mashed potatoes, not a mix. Yes. We blend it with cheddar cheese, crispy bacon, <laughs> uh, top it off with some sour cream. Yes. And it's one of our most popular appetizers. In fact, it's so popular, we just created a version of it that is a uh, spinach artichoke dip Ooh. inside the same uh, deep dish crust. It's I'm intrigued. I haven't tried that one yet. Now, you, you, you mentioned dessert, and you're right. You do uh, the deep dish dessert. It's actually a, a deep dish uh, ice cream sundae. Day, basically so what explain what this one is we love to cook in deep dish pans Apparently so. <laughs> and so we've created a, a deep dish cookie sundae yes it's chocolate chip cookie hand stretched they're made to order so it comes out hot 
topped with vanilla ice cream, uh, chocolate sauce, some whipped cream. It, it's a fantastic <laughs> dessert. Yeah, it's one of those things like when you put the spoon in, you start to get every layer, the warm fudge, cool ice cream, gooey chocolate. And then just like on the pizza too, you get that little bit of crispiness kind of, right. you know, uh, at that bottom layer, which really to me just makes the whole thing rounded out. Now, I recently was in the uh, Uno's in Braintree, actually, okay? I walk in, you're there, and you are at a table <laughs> full of uh, plate after plate after plate, and there were chicken wings. Yep. And, and I came to realize you're my kind of guy, because you, you have a bit of it. well, you're obsessed with your appetizers in general, because you guys have really upgraded your appetizers, but chicken wings specifically has become like a passion of yours. Yes, uh, <laughs> I've, I've been driving everybody crazy with chicken wings. <laughs> My family's tired of going out to eat with me because I go to chicken wings everywhere I go. I, you know, taking pictures, sending right. them to chef every every time I'm out with wings. You're determined to find the perfect wing for Uno's. We got to keep improving them all the time. That's yeah. what we live on. It's our mantra is yeah. always continuing to improve. And uh, they're, they're ready to kill me. It's, uh, <laughs> it's I, 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 you know, we have this whole, we have a Chicago Fire wing. And I keep saying to chef, chef, it, this needs to be hotter and hotter. And he keeps saying, you have no heat receptors in your mouth. So you have this ongoing battle that we're trying to work yeah, out. Yeah, but you have all I, the different styles. And I got to say, your wings are really good because they are, they're big and meaty, which is how I like chicken wings. I, I love wings and, you know, I'm very passionate about it. It goes great with our craft beer. Well, there you have it, everybody. I'm telling you right now, if you haven't been to Uno's in a while, you got to go. Thank you, Louis Salinas. To find an Uno's near you, you just go to unos.com. Up next, it's chocolate, marshmallow, and graham crackers like you have never seen before. We'll tell you which one of these s'mores is at the top of the food chain. And also, Phantom will name one restaurant and one favorite dish from today's show, so don't go anywhere. The Phantom Gourmet is presented by Line 39 Wines, versatile wines of consistent flavor and quality. Harrow's Chicken Pies, the greatest chicken pies on the planet. And Dadgar Insurance, official insurance agency of the Phantom Gourmet.